because you're always trending on Twitter. You have 600 million views for um, the hashtag Angie Salvation on TikTok. You have Magulang, you have Minions, and all of the other supporters, the titas, and your social media accounts have increased significantly. So how do you handle now the, the fame that you're getting? Actually po, I don't really like... Actually po, di po sa, to sa totoo lang, to be honest, I really haven't like adjusted yet like to the, ano din, to the fame. Parang nahihiya ko sabihin ng fame, yung fame eh, kasi parang... I'm this it's the same pa rin ako pa rin to kasi but then um to think lang na there's a lot of people like who like appreciates me who like supported me and like like sent talaga their love their love to me um it just it's just overwhelming lang po and I think po na it will take me then it will take me talaga a long like a long time to adjust to it but I just wanted to say it lang then na um Overall, I am grateful at handa na ako, nagpunta ako dito um, kasi alam ko sa sarili ko handa na ako. So, um, actually, parang okay lang naman po. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's your, ano, what was the first um, food you ate when you stepped outside of the house of Kuya? Or when you got out of the house? Ano yung first food na kinain? Um, pizza po. Pizza. Hindi <laughs> ko na yan, yung, ano, yung, ano, yung brand. Oh, wow! Po. All right. And um, also, I want to ask before we go back into the questions we have, what's your biggest takeaway or what was the biggest learning um, you've gotten from being inside Kuya's house? Yun po talaga palagi ko talaga din to sinasabi na yung biggest takeaway, biggest learning ko po talaga dun sa bahay ni Kuya is yung self love din po talaga. Kasi during talaga the time when, um, I was like very down sa bahay ni Kuya. I told Kuya kung ano yung sa loobin ko. And then Kuya suddenly like told me na um, Angie, bata ka pa pero pagod na puso mo. And I always said this to lahat ng interviews ko. It really hit talaga my core. Um, na wow. Na ano ko na move ako na oh, I should love talaga myself first before I could love other people. Give that care and love for myself first before I could give it to someone else. Yeah, exactly. I like that. You have to love yourself first. For you to be able to give that love to others. I like that. And we can actually see your progress and we celebrate it on a daily. So, maraming maraming salamat sa buhay mo. And then another question from mainly Angie. What's the first thing you're going to do or you're planning on doing when you go back to Siargao? And when do you plan to go back to Siargao? I don't know kung when pa pwede makauwi sa Siargao, but whenever na may flight na pwede, na pwede po talaga iuwi, uuwi po talaga ako. But the first thing that I will do sa Siargao, syempre, I would hug po talaga my nanay, tatay, and my brother, my mom, my cousin there, Atilaika, and Auntie Mami. I'll hug them so tight. That's the first thing that I will do. <laughs> uh, do you have any plans of joining pageantry, yung mga pageants, beauty pageants, ganyan? Like maybe mm. two, three years from now? Um, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> is it something that you know you've thought uh, of like maybe at, at the back of your mind as a fallback plan maybe yes po as I for like <laughs> kasi ang dami kong pangarap talaga gusto maging dati talaga ng maliit ko sobrang ambisyosa ako sabi nga nila ng ano ng mga like classmates ko ang ambisyosa naman ito si Kana kasi grabe po talaga ako magka-dream sabi ko gusto kong maging model gusto kong maging beauty queen gusto kong maging artista lahat talaga pinapangarap ko sabi ko dancer na ako gusto kong maging dancer ganun po so yes po and I'm not like and there's nothing wrong with that. Mm -mm. Yeah. What are the things that you want to achieve this 2022? I mean, sorry. Oh. Yeah, 2022. 2021. Oh my gosh. What? What? Ano? Gusto ko po maging ano sa isang pili like gusto ko po maging part po sa isang teleserye. Yan po yung pinaka goal ko ngayon. Chaka makapag ano po ng album po. Oh. This yeah. We want yes. that too. Are there any plans or is it in the work na ba? Yung um, ano yung yes. album. Have you? I mean, are you in talks with someone? Kami na lang magpo-produce, Chara. <laughs> <laughs> um, secret pa po. I'll tell you. I'll tell you soon. Okay. Okay. Napanood mo na ba yung Hanggang Dito Lang M MV? What was your reaction? I know the answer to this, but what's your reaction and what's your answer to that? My reaction po, to be honest po, malungkot po yung song, yes. Malungkot po yung song. But the thing po na yung pagmumuka ko ay nandun, natatawa po ako. <laughs> parang ang ano po, parang di po ako bagay doon. Ang ganda-ganda ng song. Tapos yung nandun ako, nakita ko yung pagmumuka ko. Sabi ko, Ginagawa ko dyan. Oh, hindi. Oh. Like, G, anong ginagawa mo dyan? 
<laughs> Pero I'm so happy po kasi, well, di ko to actually alam. I just actually do this from yesterday, di ba, the test. And na-surprise mm-hmm. lang ako. Grabe po talaga. Tapos gabi po, ang dami pong nanood doon. Tsaka dami ng comment. Thank you po sa mga nanood. Stream niyo po siya, guys. Sa YouTube po, stream niyo po siya. Tsaka mag-comment na kayo doon ng marami. Yung iba, ayaw nilang panoorin because masakit. Masakit daw. Parang kagat masakit. ng dinosaur. Masakit <laughs> yarn. <laughs> masakit yarn. Oh my God. No, but um, it actually, you guys made history because yun yung MV that was just taken out of, you know, the, what was the real happenings without you even knowing that it came out na, diba? So it was really organic. Yeah. It wasn't something that was scripted, staged, or anything like that. So, grabe. Real emotions from real people. Diba? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Like, okay. <laughs> Okay, Angie, Kuya Mo Albi has been all out giving you the support since he got evict- evicted until now. What did you feel that you just found a genuine Kuya in him and what is your message for him? How do I feel that he's such a genuine Kuya to me? Kabe, super yeah. Kuya Albi is such an angel. He's my he's my guardian angel actually. Doon sa bahay ni Kuya and until now to think na he really like supported me. Tsaka pinagtanggol niya talaga ako sa lahat ng mga nagbaba sa akin. And I was like, I was crying when I saw this TikTok na pinag pinagtatanggol niya. Ay, ako, pinagtatanggol niya ako na iyak ako doon. Kuya Albi, love you. I love you, Kuya. And <coughs> sorry po, tumatahol ulit ako. And I just wanted to like tell Kuya Albi, Kuya Albi, you know that you came then in my life in a very unexpected way. I never thought na magka-close tayo kasi um, dati po talaga, mainitin talaga ulo mo. <laughs> I'm scared of you before, but I am so glad na I get to meet this other side of you na yung totoong ikaw na who is very gentle and very sweet and a very caring kuya um, to me. And not just to me then, kasi parang sa lahat din ng girls sa PBB, you are so sweet then po. Um, especially to Shai. I love you, Kuya Abs! Promote pa Shai Bina. No, but um, I know that... Go ahead, go ahead. Sorry. Nagsisig date na pa si, pala sila din Manila ko pinadala. Ang weird. Sana sumama ka. Third, uh, I don't third wheel. Ayoko third wheel. <laughs> Pagod na ako. <laughs> Pagod ka maging third wheel? Pwede naman ikaw sa ano front seat. <laughs> no, pwede ni Bawal pa, Bawal, Bawal. Kailangan magbigay sila ng 100 million diamonds to date you. I mean, to even talk to us first. Charot na. Anyway... <laughs> Pero di ba yung friendship mo kay Albi, it was something that was really unexpected. Paano siya nangyari? How did it come about? Like, how did it develop and it progressed into this level of closeness you have with him now? Gabi si Kuya. It's because then of Kuya. Kasi I asked Kuya where to ask then an advice. Because diba during that time then, I feel like so down. And I don't know where to mm-hmm. share it. And I don't know how to find then my own happiness. And I don't know how to find myself. And Kuya tell me, right? alam, may alam akong isang tao na pwede makakatulog sa'yo. And then, sabi ko, sino Kuya? Tapos sabi ni Kuya, Kuya Albi mo? Tapos ko, huh? Sabi ko, huh? Kasi si Kuya Albi palaging galit yun eh. Dati palaging galit. Lagot ako yun yung Kuya Albi pa makikita ko ni Kuya Albi talaga. So, <laughs> Kuya Apis! <laughs> tapos, Go ahead. Tapos, nung pinag-iisipan ko talaga siya, so, kung sinabi man ni Kuya na um, dapat yung Kuya Albi ako mag-ask, so I should trust din Kuya. Kasi he knows then, he knows then like who the people who can, I trust then and who I could tell it to. So, there. Mm-hmm. Kuya Albi has right. actually, ano, um, nag-aano siya ng bread, nagtotoo siya ng bread sa air fryer, tapos bigla na lang mm-hmm. sumulpot sa kanya, sa Kuya Albs, can I ask you something? So, sabi ko na, tapos, lumingon siya, tapos sabi ko na, ay, wag na lang, alam mo naman, alam ko naman yung isasagot mo sa akin eh. <laughs> tapos, <laughs> Pero yung pala, hindi ko pa talaga alam kung ano yung isasagot niya. Tapos bigla na lang sinabi ko, no, no, say it to me, say it to me, bro. You know, you can say anything to me. Tapos sabi ko lang, Kuya Aldi, um, um, is it okay lang po na, <coughs> like, how to be happy? How to be genuine? Oh. Tapos sabi niya na, you can be happy all you want na hindi ka nakakaapak ng ibang tao. Basta alam mo oh. lang sa sarili yung totoo mong nararamdaman. Aww. And sabi, yun din yung pagkasabi niya dun. And then, if you're truly happy then you could like, hindi na din mahirap sa'yo din yung tumulong din. Kasi if you're happy, it means that you love yourself then Kasi you'll you'll find that happiness in you. And right. you're able then to share that happiness then to others. Have you already found that? I mean, do you, do you already know <laughs> how to be genuinely happy? And are you genuinely happy right now? Yes, I know po how to be ano, genuinely happy, how to find my gen- genuine happiness. And I am genuinely happy right now. My family... My family is like the very, one of the very big reason why I'm genuinely happy and especially God. Kasi siya po talaga yung parang nagpapalinis, nagpiklens talaga ng puso ko, kiniklens siya talaga po lahat ng pait na nararamdaman ko um, ng time, ng, ng time na mga, ng mga yun. Because after that, before I went to sleep, talagang um, ay natulog ako, tsaka ipinagdasal ko siya. And then Aww. everything just happened like magic. 
Yeah, because all that is asked in prayer, in prayer you shall receive in His perfect time, diba? Right?